Protector um, Act provides in Section 72 that uh, no one is supposed to be publishing any information during the investigation unless they get permission from the public protector. Therefore, after investigating, normally we will be preparing provisional reports, but we call them Section 79 reports, where we give an implicated party an opportunity to give us their side of the story. Alternatively, where we have a closing report, like the current one where we issued uh, the closing report to the member of the DA to comment whether they've got additional information they have so that we don't close the report and not find the relevant or implicated minister uh, to have violated the Executive Ethics Members Act. But then if then a person discloses that information, even if we've mentioned that that information shouldn't be disclosed, that is purely interfering in the operations of the pilot protector, which is violation of the Constitution. And secondly, it causes a reputational risk for the institution. It makes people not to trust the institution and to doubt the institution because even the person who's being investigated, it's impacting on their dignity. Therefore, it's not right to leak any provisional report or any evidence which the public protector is still busy investigating until the report is issued.